I saw these strange looking shapes on top of these boulders here on Google Earth. So I got in my car, drove the long distance, and when I got there, I flew my drone to the spot. I stopped at this thing first. It seemed like something was here on Google Earth, but when my drone got close, it looked like just a pile of rocks, except for this one section here, which looked like remnants of a stacked rock wall. As I was flying my drone nearby, I saw these stacked rocks underneath an overhang. It was clear to me that this was once a structure. Was it a granary or a dwelling? Next up was the thing that made me drive all the way out here in the first place. I'm sure you can imagine my shock when I first saw this. This was such an amazing thing to see. Even though it's not in the best shape, it is quite rare to see stacked rock ruins like this with the entrance door still intact. Obviously this would have originally been a larger structure. It is still amazing to see. It looked like it would have been shaped in a circle, but I'm not sure. Why would they want to build this here at this spot? To me, it seemed like this would be in a protected area on top of these short cliffs. It had a great vantage point too. While flying my drone, I noticed something in the background of the video. Is this another ruin? Well, let's go find out. To my surprise, it wasn't just one ruin. There are multiple ruins here. I couldn't believe just how much was going on here at this location. I was beginning to imagine a larger community here. I tried to get close with my drone, but not too close. Take a look inside this little cave or alcove. If I had to guess, it kind of looked like someone came by and dug these ruins up. Possible looting and stealing of these ancient artifacts. These are right on the edge. The original builders used the natural caves and crevices to build their dwellings and granaries. I didn't find just ruins. I saw some amazing petroglyphs and pictographs along the walls of these cliffs too. You can even see remnants of another ancient structure just below the rock art. The pictographs are these things painted here, this white figure and red zigzag. We will probably never know exactly what they mean. So what is a petroglyph and what is a pictograph? Petroglyphs are rock carvings, usually created by pecking or carving onto the rock surface. Pictographs are rock art, but painted, just like these ones right here. I found what I think are more remnants of structures on these ledges. What do you think these would have been used for? It looks like these rocks were placed here by someone long ago. And then I saw this. I'm not really sure what's going on here. Probably another type of ruin? What do you think? And check this out. Inside this little cave are more pictographs. Still with vibrant colors, despite being over a thousand years old. I doubt many people have ever seen these. Except for us now, of course. I was scouting some cliffs and saw these petroglyphs. Look at just how many are on this panel. There are dots, animals, human-like figures, and more. 
Again, we just don't know the context or meaning behind these petroglyphs. So, how old are these ruins? I know of a granary very close to this that was dated to about 1000 AD. So it is my belief that these could be from 1000 AD also. I can't imagine dozens of people calling this area home back then. I felt very lucky to have been able to see it. And I hope you enjoyed this special adventure too, this was really fun.